Welcome to Linux help tutorial. Now we are going to see about the installation of MariaDB in CentOS 7. First, let me create a repo file. The location is m etc yum.repo.d and the file name mariadb.repo and create a file and paste this content inside the file and save it now give yum install mariadb iPhone server and MariaDB iPhone client. Now give enter. You can see here MariaDB the repo file which we added. Here give yes, that is why to download the packages and their dependencies. Give enter. Now the package is started downloading. Now it asks for importing the GPG key. US to continue. And again yes. Now the downloaded packages are installing. Now the installation is completed successfully. Now let us start the service. To start the service, go to the path etc. init dot d mysql and start now the service is started the next command is I'm giving my SQL here you can see welcome to MariaDB monitor now we have entered into my SQL you can see the database using the command show databases and always end commands with semicolon and give enter here you can see the database the next is now I am exiting exit the next procedure is I am going to secure the MariaDB for that give mysql underscore secure underscore installation and give enter here you can see enter the root password this is the first time we are going to configure the MariaDB so just give enter and it asks to set root password give yes and enter the root password and again re-enter the new password and next remove anonymous users by default the MariaDB creates that is by default it consists of some anonymous users let me delete this and we can create it later if we require and next is disallowing root login remotely that is we are going to disable the root login from remote computers that is from remote hosts this is for secure purpose only the root from the local host can access this I'm giving yes and next is remove test database and access to it the test database is just you can see here the test this is created by default for a sample purpose and now I'm removing this give yes and reload privilege tables now give yes so that the changes we made takes effect now let me restart the service etc init.d mysql and restart now the service is restarted now let me again try to enter into the mysql when i give just mysql as we given earlier it says error 
only the root user is allowed to access the MySQL so I am giving the command is MySQL space hyphen u space root and hyphen p now it asks for password as we said earlier and you can see the database test is removed here you can see database test is removed and you get to exit thank you